we decided, since it's getting ready to snow and be winter, we decided to make our own terrain park. So this is our progress. We made it, we flattened out the slope going down towards the jump, where the rock pile is down there. That's the starting of the jump. Um, and then down there on the mountain where the snow's taking out, that's gonna be our quarter pipe. We haven't quite cleared out all the bumps, so we're gonna do that right now, and after that, we'll get back to you. So we've gotten out all the bumps, but there are still some bumps that we haven't gotten out yet. But keep in mind, because there's gonna be snow over it, which will make it a lot more easier to make it more level. So we actually just remembered that we have a plastic jump, and so we moved all the rocks that were where this plastic jump's gonna go to here, because this one's gonna be a really big jump, so let's see if this one fits. The plastic jump fits pretty well in this spot. Let's scoot it up. It's pretty good. To get a little more rocks over here. Yeah. Those rocks are cool. So the rock foundation is all good, but we just need a little bit boulders to go right there just so the plastic junk they can fall off but I think they're all pretty steady. So now we're gonna go ahead and do the quarter Karen, pipe. You got the pickaxe see how this turns out. Alright so before we start digging we gotta clear out all the sticks and branches and leaves and snow so sweet. Can you grab and toss into there because we need all that leveled out. So we got all of our sticks and leaves off of our quarter pipe. It's getting late and dark. We're gonna have to call it a day. It's supposed to snow tonight, so I hope we don't get too much where we can't continue tomorrow. Right here there's some dead branches that we need to make room to get air on the quarter pipe, so we're gonna have to cut them off. But most of them are dead, so. And we, so we cleared out all the dead branches, but this one we're keeping to be a plant branch. So now we're going to start digging out the quarter pipe. We'll get back to you when it's done. So this is the progress we made. We put a lot more dirt on it. And we changed our mind about the little jump. We're going to grab that plastic jump, put it on the big one to make it even bigger. So, look at that. So we finished half the quarter pipe, brought all the dirt up to the jump, and put all the rocky dirt and rocks all right here to level it out. All right, so it's starting to snow pretty hard, and we're losing some daylight. We got three quarters of the um, quarter pipe done, and the jump is, um, is basically done. We've gotten a lot done today, so I think we're gonna call it a day. All right, so it's been two days. That has been snowing a lot. And just now started snowing again, and all the snow that snowed, we decided to take the plastic jump out because it was way too big, but it's still huge because we put a bunch of powder on top and patted it down. And now the landing, and then we started doing the landing, and it's 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 turning out pretty good. We just need a little bit more snow on it, and it's pretty a massive jump. We're gonna see if we can get some runs on it. Unfortunately, we didn't finish the quarter pipe because it snowed a lot too much to keep digging on it. So we're going to scratch that and focus on the jump. So we got the jump to be four feet tall. So here's the reference. Dally's there, and I'm here. So that's how tall it looks. Just to give you an idea of how long this jump is and how big it is, I'm lying here where my feet are is a landing, and where Dally's head is is not quite at the lip of the jump, but like about 
two more feet to a jump. So it's about a nine foot gap. So we ran the slope a little a couple times to make it ice, and we haven't hit the jump yet. So let's hit it. See how it works out. First attempt on the college mega. Here it goes. First attempt on the Kellogg's Mega Ramp, and we landed perfect on the landing. Let's do Dally go. snow and try to make it ice and then we'll get back. Tets on a backflip. I failed miserably. I destroyed the jump. I didn't miss it at all. With my feet. That was my sled. That was your me. back. Alright, well, getting late. I'm gonna call it a day. It's pretty cool. <laughs> so we're about to do something crazy here, and I've got a rope, and it's attached to the truck.
Hey guys, it's Brody here and we're in Columbus. We're about to surf a good wave, so we're about to get in. It's going to be one six session. So about one month ago, a video was uploaded on YouTube about a bear chasing a man on a bike. And I'm here to tell you that it's fake. And I can show you why. But first, let's watch the video. <laughs> 